In this video, you'll learn about AnySwap, a cross-chain router, a bridge, the Any token, and how to transfer assets between networks. Subscribe to the Krypton channel and let's get into it. AnySwap is a complex cross-chain solution. With its help, you can either simply transfer tokens from one network to another via a bridge or perform a decentralized swap of tokens between networks. To use AnySwap, follow the link in the description and select your wallet network. Currently, the AnySwap platform supports 17 networks that you can now see on the screen. After that, you can connect your wallet to the application by clicking on Connect to a Wallet in the upper right corner. For this, you can use MetaMask or Coin98 wallets. We have videos for each one of them. In the future, after switching the application to a new network, AnySwap will automatically offer to add it and change the current network. Using the AnySwap router, you can transfer native, that is not trapped, tokens from one network to another via decentralized exchange, which will use tokens provided by other users. This tool is mainly used to transfer stable coins. To use the AnySwap router, select the source and target networks in the application. Then select the token that you will be transferring by finding it in the search and entering the amount. Immediately after that, you will see the amount that you will receive in the target network, fees included. The AnySwap router fees for transferring tokens from any network to any other network other than Ethereum are 90 cents, with a minimum transfer limit of $12. The fee for transferring tokens using the AnySwap router from any network to the Ethereum network is 0.1% of the transfer amount and the minimum value is $45. Please note that regardless of the transfer amount, the commission cannot be less than $40 and more than $1,000. Using the send to function, you can change the recipient's address in the target network to a third party. Before making a swap, make sure that there is enough liquidity in the target network for your exchange. After filling all the desired fields, click approve and then swap and wait for tokens to arrive in your wallet on the target network. On average, exchanges on any swap router last from 5 minutes to half an hour. You can track your transaction status in the AnySwap protocol browser by clicking on the link in the pop-up window. In the pool tab, you can provide liquidity that other people can use while swapping. To do this, simply select the desired token, switch the wallet to the network where you want to provide liquidity on and click add. After you've specified the amount to send to the pool, click approve and add liquidity. In return for the send tokens, you will receive any tokens as a receipt. Using them, you can withdraw send tokens from the pool in the remove tab. Sometimes, any tokens can be sent to the farms for additional rewards. However, at the time of recording this video, all farms in the third version of the protocol have been completed. AnySwap Bridge uses wrapped tokens, not liquidity in different networks, which despite greater centralization allows transferring more tokens. For the example, we'll transfer Beefy tokens of the Beefy Finance Yield Optimizer from the Binance Smart Chain network to the Polygon network. You can learn more about the Beefy Finance Multi-Chain Yield Optimizer with more than $1.2 billion of total value logged by watching our video. The experience of using the AnySwap bridge is similar to using the AnySwap router. The only difference is that here the range of tokens is greater, and the fees differ depending on the choice of a specific token and the target network. For example, it was possible to transfer Beefy from the Binance Smart Chain network to the Polygon network without any fees at all. But for the opposite transfer from Polygon to Binance Smart Chain, you will need to pay a fee of 0.1% of the transfer amount. Note that the transfer of a large number of assets may take a long time. In addition to EVM networks like Phantom, Avalanche, Polygon and the others, you can make a transfer over the bridge between the Bitcoin or Litecoin networks and the Binance Smart Chain network in the BDC tab. In this case, Bitcoin and Litecoin will need to be transferred to the address provided by the bridge. The commission for such a transfer will be 0.1% and regardless of the transfer amount will be in the range of 0.002 to 0.01 BTC or from 0.07 to 0.5 LTC. The Any token is the native token of the platform and is used mainly for the platform governance. The emission of tokens to the circulation stopped in February 2021 at about 18.5 million Any. From now on, the team conducts a quarterly purchase and burning of tokens in the amount equal to 20% of earning on fees. The future of the remaining 80 million blocked Any is still not decided, and to determine it, the AnySwap team plans to vote on the addition of new features for the token and its gradual release from lockup. The AnySwap NFT bridge is currently being tested and will be added to the main version of the website in the future, further expanding its functionality in the range of provided cross-chain opportunities. Learn new things about cryptocurrency and subscribe to the Krypton channel and our social media. All links will be in the description.